It's a vacation, biatch. Hold on, where we at? Where we at? Jamaica, baby. Jamaica, baby. Me, I look for a bad man. Rude girl, bad girl, light skin, baby. Show the braids. Show the braids. Oh wait, you gotta see the braids. Get my braids. You see it. You see it. Hold on, yes, Miss Mama. Yes. But yeah, y'all, we outside. We just got to the motherfucking resort. Plane ride was getting me tight, but this is my first passport stamp, and I'm feeling nice. Yeah, welcome. I ain't get my welcome drink yet, but you know, I have my welcome. You know, it's her birthday, sis. Yeah, this is my mother's birthday trip. Birthday weekend ready, stop playing. You got waffles? Hell no. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. It's definitely giving tours because me in a gift shop is crazy. This is cute though. Stop playing. Look, a Jamaican Pandora Bad yeah. Y'all, I haven't been on a real vacation in mad long and I'm just too happy. Like, this shit is beautiful, bro. Like, it's really, it's really giving beautiful. Like, it's giving luxurious. It's giving like... It's giving vacation, it's giving peaceful, green nature, Jamaica, Jamaica, yes. Jamaica, that. It's giving that. not New that. York, like, we from New York, we love New York, but we get tired of New York. So we here. We're staying at the real Montego Bay Resort, y'all. It's definitely about to get big ass kids the way I'm gonna be on there. Oh shit. I'm not gonna lie, like this pineapple juice tastes like it was like made with real pineapple. Like this not no artificial corner store supermarket apple pineapple juice. pineapple juice that you get from the juice out in the can. We on our way to the Bob Marley Museum right now. One love. Every two little things gonna be alright. One love. Why can't we love each other? My life is my riches. <laughs> We got dirty Coney Island water. The detox and with marijuana. Oh. So if you drop it against marijuana or you don't smoke marijuana, you could try the detox. Oh, okay. We have some sack and we do seven different types, seven different strains. And we keep the joints roll like this. Not everyone can roll it. bit of her chicken and bread all right y'all the <laughs> tour is over <laughs> oh my forehead is beaming yeah we couldn't really record in there due to respect as respected but it was very nice and I touched Bob Marley's grave period this was very nice we learned a lot about Bob Marley and his family seen where his mother lived where they lived where he yeah, shared the single we, bed with his mother yeah we seen his mother sell this house we seen his room we seen everything the like, single size bed he shared with his mother a single <laughs> a single size bed him and his mother slept in because you know out here in Jamaica like we they don't grow up in the best circumstances so this is really nice to see very humbling experience oh nice nice, nice. yeah I love it and you seen the mausoleum his him and his mother lives in mausoleum a lay to rest in mausoleum mausoleum see and I'm learning stuff guys him and his brothers actually laid together they're in one mausoleum Bob Marley's on top his brother's on the bottom and his mother has her own right yeah yeah I love it here and my sister Love. let's just say Long she had a little she had a little too much okay. ganja <laughs> a little better <laughs> a little too much, too much. <laughs> and this area 
Well, the area is called Nine Miles, but we're at the Bob Marley Museum. We did not see the whole Nine Miles, but just know it's the hood. <laughs> All right, y'all, day two, day two, we go on horseback riding today. Is this day three? Is day three? Yes, it is day three. It's day three. It is day three. Day three, y'all, time is flying more than the equator. Um, <laughs> but today we have to go horseback riding. Horseback riding, zip lining over the water, and bamboo rafting. I can't wait to get my feet rubbed. But that's what we're doing today. The hair is. I'm claiming that girl, she's not one of them. Look at my beautiful ass mother, y'all. Bro, if I'm not the most inconsistent YouTuber, I don't know what. But fast forward guys, Jamaica has been very, very fun so far. I'm not gonna lie, for my first time out the country, it's been mad fun. Hi guys! Okay, so let me explain, cause I know y'all watching this like, bitch you ain't finished the goddamn vlog. I'ma tell you why. Basically, after the after the Bob Marley Museum, honestly, what I could say from, we, we couldn't really record anything at all. So I just had to kind of like double back and put the cameras away, but we were able to take pictures So I'll put some pictures in here We went to Mount Zion where Bob Marley and his brother is laid to rest as well as his mother and a whole nother one and it was very interesting because It was a big like thing. I forgot what it was called, but I think it was like a mausoleum mausoleum big big like it was like a big marble box i don't know how to explain it but it was amazing and we literally i touched his grave that he's actually in and now i feel like i have the gift of gab <laughs> and what's interesting is over Bob marley's grave is an umbrella and that stands for the king and on his mom's grave, there's an umbrella, but it turned upside down. So it's an upside down umbrella, and that represents the queen, and that shit is so fire, like. <laughs> but moving on, this is my first time out the country, and what I can say about being out the country for the first time at, in Jamaica, it has been a very humbling experience. And what I really like about the tour guides is that they don't only talk about, oh, Jamaica is fun, it's beautiful, people love it here. Like, no, he got down to the good, the bad, and the ugly. He taught us everything. Like, he was like, like some of us only get one meal a day. Like, the way they living out there is honestly crazy, y'all. Like, I'm not even gonna hold you. Like, like it would really make you realize that none of that materialistic shit matters. Which is, I already knew, like, y'all see, I don't even wear that much flash. Like, when have y'all ever seen me a designer? I'm already not a materialistic person. Like, I'm very humble from what I went through. This was just even more humbling. Like, none of that shit really matters. And I understand why Bob Marley said, it doesn't matter how much money I have in the bank. My life is my riches. Like, that's how I'm rich, my life. They don't really have that much running water. They really get water from captured water. So when it rains, they're happy because they capture the water, but this water, they use it to wash themselves, to wash their clothes, to cook with, to drink, to do everything with, to water their plants or whatever they got going on. And I was kind of, before I knew that, I was kind of upset that it kept raining. And I was like, damn, like, I want to swim. Like, but then when he told me that, I was like, you know what? I'm not even mad that it's raining because the locals are happy. This country I'm coming into, I can't just be like, oh, like, fuck this rain. Like, no, they love the rain, and that's why. We rode through the town. We seen the hood. We seen everything. I'm not going to lie. I really love Jamaica. I really love Jamaica, and I will come back. But, yeah, this is going to wrap up this vlog. But, yeah, this is going to wrap up this vlog because with the camera, it's not really much places I can bring it into. But, on my TikTok, I have... 
everything, like everything. I have day one, day two, day three, whatever the fuck. Y'all gotta tune in. But what I can tell you, if you ever decide to come to Jamaica, definitely do ATV riding when you ride the motorcycles. It's so fun, but you're gonna get horse shit on your legs. So, <laughs> riding in that mud, <laughs> that's not just mud. Oh, that's not just mud. You're gonna get shit on your ass. And I also did zip lining. Zip lining was mad fun. It was scary because it was literally, like at first, it was over land and it was very high and it was just scary. But I went down and it was mad fun. I'm not gonna lie, it was very fun. And then we had another zip line and another zip line that went. The first zip line was over land. We walked up like a tree house and went down. And then we went to another post and then we went over the water. We went to a zip line over the water. So it was all like a little like connecting point. It was fun. And then we zip line all the way to the end to the last mark. And it was so funny because these boys was really playing with me. Like the employees who was helping us with the zip lines, they had me cracking up. Oh my God, they was so funny. They made the experience mad fun. Like the boys who was helping us zip line, first of all, all of them kept flirting with me and my sister. <laughs> all right, I don't wanna get them in trouble, not too much. But at the end of the zip lining, why the boy at the end, one of the workers, why the, why the boy at the end gonna start shaking the zip line? And mind you, the last one I told y'all is over water. So when he shook the zip line, like my foot like splashing the water and all the water come on my face. I'm like, yo. And then I got to the end, I'm like, yo, I'm gonna fuck you up, bro. Like, I said, everybody started laughing because everybody was already at the end. I was the last one. That shit was funny, bro. That shit was funny. And lastly, we did the horseback riding. The horseback riding was mad fun. We horseback rode in the water and outside. And my horse's name was Gasita. And she was a sports horse. And that bitch, my horse's name was Gasita. And he was a sports horse. And that boy can run. It was it was fun. Everything was so fun. The place we went to for these activities was called the Chuka Caribbean Adventures. No, this is not sponsored. I'm just putting y'all onto the spot because I love y'all. But yeah, that's gonna wrap up this vlog. Like I said, if y'all wanna see more of my trip, y'all can always go on my TikTok, Instagram, and tune into that. But for now, I love y'all. Thank y'all for watching this video. And until next time. And once again, I'm sorry y'all, I could not get any more footage, but this is just a little recap of my trip so far. And this is gonna be the last recap because the last two days we're not doing any activities, we're just chilling on the resort and celebrating my mom's birthday. She's turning fitted. <laughs> but yeah, I love y'all and I'm gonna see y'all in the next one. Period. <laughs> Bitch, I just dropped my phone. It's okay.